You know what Jesus said to the Jews? He said, you err because you know not the Scriptures. He said, you err because you know not the Scriptures. When you don't know the Scriptures, you're like a blind man. And many times we've, we've seen it. When we read the Bible to some Christians, they've never known that such things were in the book. You know what's called spiritual blindness? The spiritual blindness. Spiritual blindness is when you cannot see spiritually. You're blank. You don't know what they are talking about. Somebody said, oh, no, no, no. Um, I, I, I don't believe in that. I'm not a part of religion. Just leave me alone. Uh, I believe there's a God and that's enough. Oh, come on. The Bible says your participation in the faith should become operative. It is not enough to say you have heard. That's why I'm showing you this. See, how can you have a Bible and not read it? How can you have a Bible and not read it? It's like the Ethiopian eunuch. You remember the Bible talks about it in the book of Acts? And he was studying the scriptures. Just browsing through. Didn't understand anything. Until the Holy Ghost said to Philip, join yourself to that chariot. And then he did. The man said, come up. He joined him. And... Uh, Philip looked at him and noticed he was studying the scriptures. Philip asked him a question. He said, sir, do you understand what you're reading? <laughs> he said, how can I understand except somebody guides me? Look at him. And he was reading it. And there was nobody there to guide him. So what was he doing? Religion. That's what it's all about. Reading it just to know I read it today. <laughs> he was reading. The man said, do you understand what you're reading, sir? He said, how can I? How, 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 you can't understand it? Except somebody guides you? Then he asked a very interesting question. When he read part of it, he said to Philip, he said, is the man talking about himself or someone else? <laughs> and then the Bible says, Philip started from that same Part of the Bible that he was on part of the scriptures that he was reading the scroll and then explained to him the gospel of Jesus Christ. And the man was saved. You see, though he had the scroll with him, he had the scriptures with him, he still wasn't saved. Though he was reading it, he still wasn't saved. Until someone communicated to him the message of the gospel. Remember the importance of our ministry. All right. Thank you, Lord Jesus.